Got new details this morning after what was a chaotic police chase at times in East Hartford, and it ended with two police officers hurt. And Fox News News Angelo Bavara was joining us live at the East Hartford PD this morning with an update. Angelo. Good morning, guys, and we do have some good news to share this morning because we know that both of those police officers that were injured during this are out of the hospital at this point. One suspect has also been arrested, but police, they're still looking for two other suspects that were involved in this chaotic incident that happened last night. So this all started when officers spotted a stolen vehicle on Park Avenue last night. That stolen vehicle then hit a police vehicle and an officer was injured there. Police then chased that suspect car as it fled north on Main Street, but they eventually stopped pursuing that car. And then later on, an officer spotted the suspect car once again and followed that car behind a warehouse near Park and Franklin. And that is when that suspect car rammed into another police car head on, which disabled that suspect car. Three suspects then got out and ran. The second officer who was hit does report that he's injured, but he did try to catch those suspects. But then one of those suspects ends up stealing that second cruiser that was hit. The suspect did end up crashing that cruiser into a pole, which caused wires to fall and total that vehicle. The suspect then took off once again, but the canine unit did locate him and he was bit by a canine. Police say that suspect was a 15 year old male who was also treated at the hospital and has since been released as well. Still no information on those other two suspects who they could be at this point. Of course, as we get any updates throughout the morning, we'll get them to you live here on air and on the Fox 61 News app. Reporting live in East Hartford this morning, I'm Angelo Bavar, Fox 61 News. Okay, Angelo, thank you for that update.